Hey everyone, welcome back to the OP Summer Series where we are reviewing protocols that are giving out massive amounts of OP tokens this summer. Today, we are covering Lyra Finance, which is offering some of the best delta neutral yields on Optimism. And as far as I can tell, with the addition of the OP tokens from OP Summer, they have some of the best yields in the entire Ethereum ecosystem. Not only that, but Lyra has the potential to be the options trading platform on chain. Right now, they're only offering Ethereum options trading, but in the future, they could offer options trading for a huge number of assets, including stocks. In this video, I'm going to walk you through how Lyra works and how you can earn yield as a liquidity provider for this options platform. So what is Lyra? Lyra is an automated market maker or AMM for options. You may have heard the term automated market maker before because this is what the biggest decentralized exchanges like Uniswap are. Automated market makers are new to crypto and they offer a number of advantages over traditional order book type exchanges. The main difference is that instead of needing someone to be on the opposite end of a trade, you can trade directly with a protocol. The liquidity pools and protocols like Uniswap set the price of the assets and automatically update as trades are made. So what's so special about Lyra? When you're simply trading one asset for another, it's relatively easy to price these with an automated market maker but the pricing function for options is a lot more complicated. Traditionally, pricing an option requires a lot of variables, like the strike price, expiration date, risk-free interest rate, and volatility. Lyra has managed to create a decentralized application that prices these options with the help of liquidity from a delta neutral vault. That delta neutral vault is the way that we as liquidity providers can earn yield from fees from Lyra protocol. So how does the vault work? You can enter Lyra's vault by depositing synthetic US dollar, which is a US dollar stablecoin, into their protocol. These dollars serve as the counterparty for anyone trading options on Lyra's platform. As a reward for contributing to the vault, you get fees from the trades that the options traders make, but it is important to note that the value of your deposit can go up and down because you are the counterparty to these trades. Currently, Lyra only offers options on Ethereum. You're able to trade any flavor of option that you want, meaning that you can buy or sell short calls or puts. All of these options are cash settled options, which means you don't have to worry about exercising an option. You can buy an option and then forget about it and then come back after expiration to claim any value that was left when the option expired. So even though the vault is acting as a counterparty to the options traders, there are a number of things that Lyra has implemented in order to make this vault much more delta neutral. If the majority of options traders on Lyra were long Ethereum and the price of Ethereum skyrocketed, then the vault would get wiped out. But Lyra has mechanisms to prevent this and make the vault more delta neutral. They do this by taking vault reserves and either going long Ethereum if the options traders are biased long or short Ethereum if the options traders are biased short. The 30-day annualized performance for the Lyra vault is almost 27%, which is the combination that the vault has earned from the trading fees and as acting as a counterparty. On top of that 27%, the Lyra vault is also offering 14.5% in OP token rewards. Also, when the price of Lyra moves above 20 cents, Lyra rewards are added to this mix. Let's walk through how you can actually deposit into Lyra because there are a few things that you need to know. Things first, the Lyra vault uses SUSD, which is Synthetics Stablecoin. I'm going to trade a little bit of ETH for SUSD on Uniswap right now. You can do that by just searching SUSD and clicking on Synthetics USD. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and swap that and then hit confirm. And then just confirm the transaction on MetaMask. I actually have my MetaMask hooked up to my Ledger wallet, which is really the safest way to store your crypto and how I store most of mine. So if you want one and you want to support the channel, I'll put an affiliate link below. Now I want to see that SUSD in my MetaMask, so I'm going to go ahead and hit import tokens. And then I'll just paste the contract address in here, which I'll make sure to put in the description of this video. Hit import token. And great, now we can see our synthetic USD. Now comes the fun part where we can actually earn yield. So I'm on Lyra's website and I'm on the vaults section. Go ahead and hit connect wallet to connect to your blockchain wallet. And then scroll down and hit this deposit button. As you can see, there's over $15 million deposited in the vault right now. So just go over here on the right, 
put however much you want to deposit. I'm going to deposit all of my SUSD and then take a look at this deposit delay. In order to limit attacks on the vault, there's a delay of three days when you deposit and seven days when you withdraw. I'm pretty sure that during this time, you're actually not earning any fees from Lyra. So keep that in mind. It's not the best strategy if you just want to hop in and out really fast. I'm going to allow Lyra to use my USD. And this is something that you should actually get in the habit of doing. I'm going to edit the permission. By default, most decentralized applications will ask for unlimited token approval, but this is just more risky to you as a user. So I like to always create a custom spend limit. In this case, I'm going to limit that to just 200 SUSD because I'm depositing 185. This means that in the future, I'll have to do a custom spend limit again, but it's better to be safe than sorry. Hit save and then approve that transaction. Again, I'm going to confirm on my ledger and now you should be able to hit deposit, but you might need to refresh the page, which I did. And now I can hit deposit. Once again, confirm in your MetaMask and on my ledger. So there you have it. You are now deposited into Lyra's vault. By scrolling down, you can see your pending deposit. And in three days, this will start earning yield. There is one more important thing that you need to know that could double your yield. And that is staking. By staking the Lyra token, you can boost this reward APY level to double what it is. In order to fully double your reward APR, you need to have a proportion of the staking pool that's equal to your proportion of the vault. You can either click on this boost button or the stake button to go over to the staking page. And if you have the Lyra token, you'll be able to stake it here and you'll be able to see your updated APY here. I hopped over to another wallet so you can see that I am staking a few Lyra tokens and I've doubled my APY on the rewards. So as soon as each epoch ends, you'll be able to claim your OP rewards and there's something very important that you should do with them. First of all, you could just sell the OP tokens if you want the cash, but if you believe in optimism, you should go and delegate your OP tokens. Optimism basically has a short list of delegates on their website that have committed to reading the governance proposals and voting. Delegating your tokens signifies participation in the Optimism network and could set you up for future airdrops. I am actually a delegate and I'll make sure to put my link below so that you can delegate your tokens to me. To do that, all you have to do is click on my profile and then click select as a delegate and then confirm the transaction in your MetaMask. So right now, Lyra is looking like an amazing yield farming opportunity and they are an incredibly promising protocol. As they prove out their options automated market maker, they could add options for almost any asset. More specifically, because they're using synthetics, they could add any synthetics asset to their options platform. Eventually, this could even include things like stocks. If you want to learn about other protocols that are giving OP tokens to their users, hit the subscribe button because I'm doing a whole series on OP Summer. Remember to always do your own research and I'll see you in the next video.